Hello you, welcome to Geekism and welcome to a little bit of a first look at Founder's Fortune. Um, this one is uh, a colony builder, similar kind of to um, uh, foundation I guess kind of style, you know, sort of building up wood and stone and collecting crystals and research and all that kind of thing. Um, it's currently in alpha and the best thing is it's a free alpha, so if you fancy on playing this yourself, check the uh, description, there'll be a link to where you can go and download it and have a play. So we're going to jump in. Um, you can go for Calm World, Exciting World, or Dangerous World. I think we'll go Exciting to see how we get on. And we can get to choose a couple of starting colonists. Now, I find that if you randomly click these, I mean, again, you'll get like a really good one. So, Doctor and a Forester. I kind of want to go for like Forester Medic or something like that. Forester Miner. Two Forester. Okay, let's see what we can do with this one. Mining would be good, or Farming would be good, actually. Uh, click, clicking through until something jumps out. Craftsman and Farmer. The uh, problem is when you when you click them, there's no way of going back. Craftsman and soldier, farmer, craftsman. Is, oh, that's a good good point. So I'm thinking I'm going to keep that one. Okay, so Wolfgang and Charlotte are going to be our two that we start off with. And um, yeah, it is very early alpha, so please bear that in mind as you see the gameplay. But there's actually quite a lot in development here. It's quite a lot going on. Um, one thing I will say is that I can't actually rotate the screen because my middle mouse button is broken. I can scroll with it, but I can't actually press down. Oh, I can. Oh, why does it work sometimes and not others? It's so weird, but the mouse is definitely on the way out. Um, I just want to check this isn't a... Uh... No, because I just very briefly playing through, I always have one little go at something to make sure the game's working. I came across a village like this one. And these are not friendly little dudes, okay, but the game looks great and it's got a fantastic little art style. We'll probably start out, where are they? They're over there. I think we could probably start out here and be pretty safe about it. So, first things first, then we need a bonfire. So we'll build a bonfire here, down the sort of where our, where our sort of town centre will be, which I guess is not a good, bad space for it there. And we have to tell them to go here. They will just automatically find tasks from the looks of things. Um, but they've got to be near those tasks, okay, so we're going to get them to come over and you'll find then that once they're nearby they should get, well there we go, they figure it out and they get work on it, nice. So we have a bonfire, they're going to be happy with that, the next thing they need is somewhere to sleep, now I assume we can build houses for them eventually, but to start off with we're going to put down a couple of sleeping bags, we need to get some more cotton at some point, is that cotton? Yeah, okay. So we need to fulfill our expectations, it's going to tell us here, look, yes, needs a sleeping spot. Um, which they now have two of, so we can suggest them to those people, there we go. So I can only imagine we're not going to end up with a huge group of people because they are very individually uh, controlled right now. So unless maybe as it moves on we develop, but I think to start off with, uh, it looks like we're going to have pretty good control. I want you to actually gather cotton, there we go. Yep. And I want you to start working on some of these crystals because that's something else I know we're going to need in a moment. Um, so for now, they can just get started on picking stuff. He's just going to smack that with his hand. Nice. So my uh, first migrant has arrived on a boat. So wherever somebody is, how much cotton do we have now? 15 cotton. Um, we can come and greet you. Let's turn that around. There we go. And accept the migrant. Okay, okay. So we need to build a research book stand. That's where we're going to have a research tree to figure out what we build next. But interestingly, uh, you can't build that outside. You have to build it indoors. So we're going to begin with a really simple uh, little house because I don't really know to, as to what scale uh, these need to be right now. We don't have any stone so we'll build a wooden one there we go but i like the uh the various options here for different stuff i think we'll be able to do some really cool creative stuff with this later on put a window at the back of it there they're going to get started on that and when that's built we can uh, stick a research thing in it like i said eventually we'll have another go at these i'm hoping we can get rid of them i'm sure we can is it that one down there Oh, they've all fell asleep. Oh, one of them doesn't have a sleeping bag. We have the cotton for it now. So let's build them a, a sleeping bag for uh, in the morning. Or get it built in the morning at least. Sorry about that. You come and join our colonist, Ramona, and you, I'll make you sleep on the floor. don't think there's a way of skipping through the night at the moment. 
this doesn't seem that way. Uh, apologies if you can hear a bit of wind, by the way. I've got the uh, the, the, the uh, French doors open because it's a little warm here today. I'm still going to use the old temperatures here in Canada. Okay, so let's just slow down a little bit. They've got themselves another bed. I just heard it get put together. So now we can come in here and go to work, research book, and then we can... Oh, and then we can place that down here. Oh, the place is blocked. Is it blocked by the window, is it? Okay. So let's select that to be um, Ramona. Okay. Low spirits. She'll be, she'll be better now, I'm sure. You've got a bed. That's good. So we can select research up here. Let's have a look. So we've got woodworking. Um, a simple wooden dresser, a wooden barrel, a toolmaker's workshop, simple wooden pillar, wooden axe and wooden pickaxe, or... Soil for tomatoes, soil for potatoes. So farming really should be the first thing, but I'm thinking pickaxe and axe will help us get wood and stone. So I'm thinking that's probably uh, a little more important. We have one crystal, so can we make you two uh, crystal gatherers? There we go. And get started on them. We have to watch. We've got some more there, but obviously we have to watch for them. They will come down and, and have a go if they think they're hard enough. There we go. So... Maybe what can we get you doing? All the cotton's gone. Oh, there's more cotton there. Come on then, come and gather that cotton. Uh, because I'm assuming we'll need more sleeping bags as they research. So it says here we need five crystals. Analyze crystals on the book stand. Okay. And does that make them go? Let's have a look. We'll wait till we've got the five first. Carlos are hungry, okay, let's build something from which they can get food from, which I think is one of these, basket of raw food, there we go, so we'll put that down there, and we can move you both over here now, kind of happy with what you've done, so, analyze crystal, is that something else we can do, do they both try and do that? There you go, you do, the, you do that thing instead, there you go. So analyzing crystal, maybe that makes that go one there. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so they'll get the five. There we go, two. Tell you what, now you've done a couple, you come and get some raw food and you go and analyze the crystal. Or, or don't get some food, there you go, now you're eating, okay. Expectation fulfilled. Good stuff. Uh, wish Life satisfaction level one. Wishes needs to be fulfilled. I wonder what that is. Owns a sleeping spot. Next one is sleeps inside. Life satisfaction level one. Uh, okay, you've unlocked woodworking. Oh, nice. Okay. So, let's see if we can get... A oh! We can move stuff around. Okay. Can we get you two back on crystals? Because we're going to need another couple to do the farming stuff. You, Mr. Per oh, there we go, personality. So let's have a look. No job, combat, important professions, health, personality. Can't see any mention of... Oh, there, is it that one? Life satisfaction level one. Got to get a bedroom and get a toolmaker's bullshit for the colony. Right, I think a little bedroom then is probably not a bad idea. We'll go for farming. Uh, you pair getting some crystals in? Okay, cool. So let's have a look at building a little, uh, like a little dorm, a little bunk room. Um, let's place the floors down. Let's go from this being the middle. Like a like a nice looking shape like that would be quite cool. Walls. There we go. Oh, we don't have enough wood. Okay, so can we? Do we get the wood back for doing that? No, we've just lost all of that. Okay, nice. Uh, all right. Well, you've got somewhere to sleep tonight, I guess, folks. Get yourselves your head down. We'll finish this building off in the morning. And, uh, and hopefully we can move the professions. Give jobs to your colonists to automate some tasks. For example, a farmer will tend to their fields. Okay, I might do that once we've got um, woodworking unlocked. 
Oh no, we have got woodwork unlocked. Okay, oh, they're getting started straight away. Nice. Uh, well, whenever somebody else wakes up. Okay, so hold on then. Let's get let's uh, let's readdress you. So, where's professions? No job. Change. I'm gonna make you a forester. And see if you just automatically go and get some wood. Or do you need a tool shed? No, 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 there you go, they're hitting wood. I imagine the tools then just increase the uh, the speed of which the, that wood is created. So I think maybe we look at doing a... Uh, tired of waiting for building materials, let a craftsman use his basic workbench to make simple tools that make your colonist's job easier. Yeah, okay, well we need some more wood. How much do we need? 35 wood there, okay. Well, see what, then let's finish off this, first of all. Uh, let's pop a door in. Hmm. Low spirits. Well, you know what? You get it. You'll get over it. Um, why are the low spirits? Who's low spirited? Yep. Let's have a look. Expectations. It's that level one satisfaction, isn't it? 40 and 75. Yeah, we're working on it. We're working on it. Okay, just finish this building up. And uh, and we'll be good to go. We've got wood coming in. That's good. I suppose probably a few windows. Window lets in more sunshine. It's basically a hole in the wall. Yeah. Well, I still want to kind of put some in, though. Okay, so... Okay. Yeah, there we go. Colonist has had too much of a terrible time. Is that what that said? Doesn't care anymore. It's going to relax for a while. Well, that's fine, I guess. You're living indoors, at least. Okay, tool makers workshop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you all, yeah, you all got that, did you? What do you want? Relax. Well, that's fine. And defeat a tiki goblin. Well, I think you're a little way off that yet, pal. In the meantime, let's give people jobs. So you're a forester. You can be a, um, um, a craftsman, seeing as you look like you're good at that. I didn't even think to look whether you were good at forestry or not. No, you're good at craftsman as well. Wolfgang, were you good at forest? Okay, so you can be a forester. Uh, Ramona, you can become a miner. If you're all rubbish at mining, you might as well be the mine. Okay, so the next thing was the toolbox then. Let's see if we can put that in somewhere. Work. Not enough wood. 35 wood needed. Okay. Where is everyone? Ramona, Charlotte, Wolfgang. Hungry. So go and eat then. Why can't I? Yep. I can't, I can't tell him to do anything. Yep. I can tell her. I can tell that one to eat raw food. We're running out. That's fine. For some reason, I can't tell Wolfgang to come and eat food. No food left. Okay, so food is this food, I guess. Wild healing plant. I was really hoping there'd be some like berries around somewhere. Hmm. Doesn't actually look like there is anything that's jumping out at me as berries. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what, then, you pair, I need you to stop what you're doing and come and get some crystals because. Actually, no, we have enough crystals, sorry. Stop. Go here. Well, you can carry on getting them because they're going to be useful, right? You can come and. Uh, Traders arrived. Analyze crystals. Okay. Do we need to get somebody to come and help us? Are you just going to ignore me, Wolfgang, until you're... or you're stuck? Is that a bit buggy? I think you might be a little bit buggy, pal. Okay. Uh, Charlotte there is doing a good job of researching, so let's get Ramona to come and talk with the trader. 
Okay. Colony is selling to the trader. Um, we could buy. We could do with some food. Uh, bread. Do we buy some bread? Colony does not have forty-four coins. No, but we can do. We can give you one of them. There we go. Confirm trade. So that should have give us some apples and stuff. Yeah, they've gone to get it. Okay, can I control you now? Mm -hmm. Wolfgang? Oh, you've gone to bed. All right. Huh. Tracers just fell asleep on the floor. Nice. Pretty chilled. Mm -hmm. Yep. The other three are all onto bed. Oh, look at the wall. Look at the wall stream down. That's really interesting. Ooh. See what? See where you going there, sunshine? Mm -hmm. Are you doing all right now? Feels good to let out frustration. Maybe life isn't so bleak after all. Okay. And you're going to get some wood, have you? Nice. Farming's done. So we could really do with a let's have a look. Nice level satisfaction one. Still needs to get done. You want a dresser? Um hold on. Yep. You want a dresser, you want a dresser and a tool station, yep. and you want to have a rest. Ramona hurt her arm. Oh dear. I don't know what to do about that. It's the last day of spring. Beautiful. Okay, we've got no research going. What should we do? Weaponry. Uh, furniture, gardening, hedge. Oh, there's lots of different stuff. Bookshot. I think weaponry is probably a good basic one to go for. So there's you, Pear. What, where's everyone else? Ramona's down here smashing it. You come over here. Oh, we can tell you to relax, Ramona. Relax. There you go. Oh wow, these wishes are like uh, like The Sims a little. So you want a table in your house and to defeat a goblin. So I think the main thing now is if we've got the wood for it, is a tool um, shelf for food from the campfire. Make sure shelf and basket's idea of a share food that's been cooked on a campfire. Okay. Must be placed in a finished room. Okay. Uh, and you must be placed in a finished room as well, my word. Okay. Do we have stone now? Is that stone there? We have three stone. Wow, okay. Desperation on low spirits already, my goodness. There we go, we've got enough for four of those. Carry on with some wooden walls. They're all going to get a kip, are they? Yeah, okay. Doors. There we go. And I guess a window. Right, so that's going to be for our tool kit. Where are you going? There we go. Can we place you down already? So, what, what have you done there? Lost consciousness. I feel like we're missing a lot of things here. Let's have a look. You're just down there on a tree. Look, your mood's bad. I haven't been. F uh, friendship's not included. That's fine. Okay, so you come over. You have a relax. Come on. Come and chill out. Uh. I don't even know where you are. Ramona, yep. your mood is terrible. Yep. Come over here and relax. Is your mood increasing? It looks like it. Do the unconscious ones stay unconscious until I do something? Oh, look at the weird eyes. Yep. I'm still out of it. Okay, can I do something? Ah, there we go. Give healing potion. What on earth just happened? 
Was it really that bad? Hold on, hold on, Wolfgang. Can we just carry to bed, please? <laughs> oh my word. There you go. Wolfgang's doing all right. Wow, that took a real turn for the worst, eh? It's summer, Wolfgang. Now what's up with you? Why are, why are people losing consciousness? Okay. Uh, are you doing all right? No, your health's going as well. I think everyone's dying. Hooray! <laughs> Uh, so a lot of people always ask me, um, how do you know whether it's going to be a first look video, like a one-off video of a game? And how do you know it's going to be a series? Well, this one's going to be a first look. Because expect expensive food. But there is food, right? Have we got food? Where's food? Raw food. No, there's no raw food. And we've got a couple of bread. But there's no way of them to get to it. I guess that's what it is, I guess. Hunger. So is that that's actually that they're very hungry? Right. Not that they're not hungry at all. I just assumed it was fill up uh, as they were. So, so maybe farming is more of an important one then. Uh, let's quickly try again. Okay, tried again. Set up very simply. Uh, one big building for all the beds and the uh, and the what's it called? The table. Uh, middle mess button won't work again. There we go. That one there. Uh, so they seem to be happy now. We're giving our food as well, and I've gone for farming straight away this time. So hopefully. Uh, let's have a look. Soil for tomatoes. Tomatoes are good crops for experienced farmers to ensure a stable food supply. Growing from spring to summer, they often provide the bulk of food supply in the beginning of the year. Uh, potatoes go from summer to fall. They go good preparation for winter and a campfire. Okay. So let's do some soil for potatoes. Okay, so it's not a click and drag job. It's a sort of four, five. I don't know how many to have. Doesn't seem to be costing us anything to do. Uh, any of you good at farming? You're you're a craftsman. You're a forester. I think you're the farmer. Yes. Okay. So uh, you need to not only can in fact let's get you all. Oh, I need to do that. Let's get. You. Oh. Oh. Okay. So escape gets rid of those. That's an interesting one. Let's uh, bear that in mind. If you've got something selected. Uh, need to select research. Okay, well, for now then we'll start on woodworking, although we're not going to be doing much of it just yet. We need to get farming up and running before we head into summer. Uh, okay, so I'm pretty sure you're our farmer. Yes, yeah, so you're going to be our farmer from now on. So just, do we need tomato seeds? Yep. You're going to be a craftsman, that's fine. You're going to be a forester. In fact, we might as well just make you craftsman because you can still get them to do stuff, right? Okay, stuff seems to be happening here. Yeah, look at that. Okay, so you can just go out of the way for a minute. You can relax for a sec. Yeah, okay. Okay, that's uh, that's good. We've got some, we've got our first tomato plants in. I imagine that once. Uh, has he got a limp? Yeah. Oh, his house full. It's supposed to look like he's walking with a limp then. Mm -hmm. Okay, Berta Beck. Doing a great job on the old Tommies. What are you what are you just yep. what are you kicking? I'm gonna kick this rock. Oh, it's a tree. You bit, you, is that genuinely what you're doing, bless you? Kicking a bit of tree. Um okay, so we'll keep that as a hut for now on. For to start off with that is. Oh, we've only got seven wood. Yep. Okay, so you're a craftsman, so do you know what? For now, I could do with you. Oh no! Yeah. I need just to kick a tree down. Cut tree. I mean, I, I'd rather you stay a craftsman, but I would like you to still cut that tree down, even though you're a craftsman. There we go. Um. Because we're kind of desperate for wood right now. We have got very little of it. So you guys, speedy, speedy through there. And we'll keep an eye on hunger. I'm hoping that you go and look after your hunger needs as you need to. I, I went for the easy playthrough this time because it gives you 100 raw food, which is a little bit more up my street. 
Uh, I'm doing alright, I guess. It's fine. Stamina's a little low, but don't worry, it's not night time yet. Uh, Day-night cycle on the screen somewhere would be good, to be honest, because I've got no idea right now as to whether or not we're... Uh, we're near, it's going dim now, look. But other than that, very little idea as to whether or not we're actually near the night. So, Berta... You're just having a chill, are you? No, you should be going to bed. There we go. Okay, everyone else. He's walking with a limp lock. And he is. Well, that's all about. Well, that's just a graphic glitch, or if it's telling me something I don't know. Uh, we had 65 wood from that little session there. That was good. So let's start putting down uh, another little hut here for uh, our train training thing. Our, our, our work. What's it called? Workbench. Doors. Do we have enough to do that? Oh, that's neat. Okay. So is somebody going to do that? Or have we got to tell them to do it? it? Looks like somebody's coming over here to have a go. Yeah. I think construction kind of takes precedent. I think they get started on construction pretty swiftly if it needs doing. Because then the next thing we're going to have is a uh, shelf for food made from a campfire. Can we get this? See, it's, see, this is a bit of a problem with these windows. They seem to block stuff. I feel like one of them will help. And then work. Uh, yeah, there we go. Oh, no, no. A bug infestation? What's that supposed to mean? Oh, over here? Yeah. Where's our farmer? Yep. Is that it then? Are you, are you on the way out? Is that all we can do is get rid of him? Okay, that's a, that's a shame, isn't it? Uh, are you just chilling? You're the craftsman. You've got very little to do, I guess. I'll tell you what you can do, craftsman. You can start analysing some crystals so that we can uh, we can build you a crafting bench because that's what you're going to be good for. This is good that while when there's nothing to do with these... Oh, she'll have a go replant them as well. That's good. Trader arrived. Okay. Maybe you can come and have a little chat with the trader. Let's see how we're getting on. We've got um, whether or not we need something from them, really. Uh, I think we're doing okay for food this time, so I'm going to say no, actually. Yeah. Can I send you on your way? Oh, I can kill you. Gather apples? That's fine. You carry on gathering apples while you're waiting for the old uh, Tommies. You're doing those scrolls. That needs to get to five gems, even. And are you over here somewhere? Mm -hmm. Having a kick of the old logs? There we go. We'll get you a tool soon. Don't worry. So you haven't, haven't got to walk around with a limp. But until you've done what you need to do, we can't. So let's speed it up. Okay, I feel like second run. Got a bit of a better idea of what's going on. Uh, oh, really? Oh, that's fine. You can eat. What was that noise there? Thilo hurt his arm. Okay, so... Let's find out what that means then. Thilo, your health's fine, but it says here you've got a sore arm. Limping. Because of an accident, Theo has a bad leg and he's limping. He walks a little slower than other colonists. Right, so the thing is, his health is full, so I don't really understand what I can do about that. And I can't imagine, like, if they've been specific enough that, uh, that certain limbs are hurting... I can't imagine that just potion is going to fix it. But we'll see. We can now do a toolmaker's workshop. There we go. And can we get you to come in and uh, construct that? No, you're going to bed. All right, well, first thing in the morning. Come on, sunshine. Come on with your limpy, limpy arm. Somebody's growing big. Oh, yeah, look, tomatoes. There we go. All right. Oh, good dream. That's nice. Trader is leaving. That's fine. Clear off. Fell asleep last time. Uh, oh, he's already up. He's got a limp and all, look. 
Okay, so with that being built, we can start working on something here. Okay, wooden, uh, wooden axe, 30 wood. I just, I want you to make one of them. As soon as you're up, can we get this tree down? We just let's research again. Okay, didn't we sign we were gonna go for weaponry last time? That's probably still a good shout. Kinda wish you wouldn't walk all the way over there. I wonder if there's a way of selecting an area to cover. Oh, there you go, there's the ten woods you needed. So now make tools. Come on then. One tomato, yeah we go, look at that. I'm assuming their class is raw food. Yeah, look at that. Apples and tomatoes, good stuff. And they keep going. Last day of spring, so let's um, let's get ready for the next set of food, which is going to be potatoes. And we'll do two rows of them. And hopefully, when she's planted a tomato, she'll get started on potatoes. You say potato, I say potato. Who says potato? I get tomato, tomato. I know. I know. Kind of. I'm personally interchangeable between the two. I am with a lot of North American words. People comment that a lot on my videos. Oh, you said trash can, but you're British. Well, yeah, I grew up watching American TV. I now live in North America. It happens. Um, but yeah, who? nobody says potato. Nobody says potato. So did we get a tool then? Right, so how do we... Doubles the amount of wood received from trees. So who, how do we give that to who I want? I wanted to give it to Philo, right? So how do we do that? Let's have a look. Forester. Ports and possessions. Good for you. Tool. Here. How do I give you that tool that's currently in there? Mate tools. Give production orders. Become a craft. I don't need to do any of them. Mm -hmm. What about you? Give production orders. What does that mean? No, that's that's not it. So come on, I've got I've got a wooden axe sitting there. Do I need to to put it on something? Storage. The ideal repository for tools that aren't in use. Okay. How much wood do we need for that? Twenty. Okay. So you come and get on cutting some wood as well. And we'll see if that goes. Okay. So I'm guessing. We can't do that because we're in the wrong season, but it's there ready. Okay, we, the wood's ready now. So now come in and uh, storage. Build one of these for us. Philo. Come at, come at it. Get yourself that set up. There we go. Okay. So now Thilo equip. There we go. It's a little bit of a funny extra stage. Um, we've got two Thilos, that's the problem. I'll make sure I've got the right one, haven't I? Yeah. There we go, wooden axe. And then I'm assuming cuts down quicker. Okay. They're all good health. Stamina's getting low, but you know, end of the day and all that. Good stuff. Alright, okay, I'm kind of happy with where we're up to. Looks like they're having a little walk around the brazier before they come and sleep. Good. Okay, feel like I've got a bit more of a hang of it now. Slow start. Well, terrible, awful, horrific start. The planes came in and there was dogs barking and all sorts. But... We've got to where we want to be. I, I might give this one another go. We'll see. Let me know in the comments. Do you want to see more of this? Do you not want to see more of this? Uh, either way, uh, I would love to know what you think. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, you give us a like. It really helps out. And if you're not already, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you to our Patreons. They make all of these videos possible for the incredible support at patreon.com slash geekism. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.